Alright, I'm back. This is what I took out. I took out the standard plug and just the uh, light bulb attachment. Just screwed on the end there. Real simple. And what I did was ran my own wire, which is a thinner wire, the LED. You don't need anything too thick. Ran it up here, and I'll show you what it looks like up top. Uh, but on this other side here, it comes out, goes to my dimmer switch, um, and then the dimmer switch, the cord goes to the power converter to convert it from the 110 out of the wall to 12 volts. And so when I turn on the dimmer, you can see the light going on and off. Um, I'll turn the overhot head up light off here a little bit, but you can see all I did was wire comes up through the bottom um, and attaches to the wire that connects to the lights. Now this is only um, eight feet of these LEDs. You can technically put as many as you want. Well, there's a limit. I could probably put um, 30 feet of LED and it would run just fine on the power supply I have. It's a 30 watt uh, power supply. Um, so I'll show you what it looks like. The overhead light off. And that's all the way lit. So the great thing about this is twofold. Number one, obviously you can dim it so you're using even less electricity than the LEDs do anyway. And number two, um, for eight feet of LEDs, they run about a dollar a linear foot. So that's about eight dollars worth of light inside. And they should last um, minimum five years. Um, and probably twice that. So this will, you know, technically never have to be replaced, at least for a very long time. Whereas a light bulb, um, even the compact compact fluorescence, uh, wouldn't last nearly as long. So that's my LED makeshift lamp. Thanks for watching.